Don't be afraid, Zoe. Open your eyes. Ay, yeah. She's just gonna start schooling, dear. Not beauty pageant. <laughs> Ma? Hmm? Don't worry. School will be fun. You'll meet new friends, learn new stuff, and who knows? You might come back and teach Ma something new. Shall we give this a little trim so that it doesn't cover your eyes? A simple trim that will give you courage to face your fears. Okay. Okay? Okay, close your eyes. What a difference a simple trim makes. Now I can finally see your beautiful eyes. You like it? Yes. So pretty. <laughs> hey, you think I look like Aries? Who? That guy on TV. This is the first time he is back after his Asian work. After the break, Hollywood director sets the sight on Singapore for his next season Alright, well then, how do you feel? It's okay. Thanks, Zoe. Do you want to have lunch with me? No, I This is the shop I was telling you about, Mr. Tan. All you need is a new coat of paint and some new furniture. Asoma, this guy is ready to buy over your space at our calling price. Um, what's up? I thought I said I still need to consider. Why do you need to consider? Oh, I'll pay up for everything. Just, just give me some more time, okay? What's going on? Nothing. Are you giving up the shop? You really did. So, right. Mm. Considering. We are not giving up the shop. Not today, not tomorrow, not ever. How much do we owe you? You're three months behind in rental. Why didn't you tell me? I didn't want you to worry. Oh, I thought we said no secrets. How much exactly do we owe? A few thousand here, a few thousand there, close to ten. We have been running on an empty tank. That's the only way to continue. If you had told me earlier, we could have worked something out. Look around the barber shop. There are no customers. Now I was just thinking, since you're going to get a proper job, maybe it's time for me to retire. I know times are bad, but we can pull through this together as a family. Are you sure you want to do this for the rest of your life? Well, I don't see what's wrong with that. That's what Ma did. We could come up with more styles. You know I have a lot of ideas. Right. That's what everyone's going for. And they don't mind paying for it. Look at this guy. How many of us can be like him? How to fight? We can if we believe we can. So 
Sorry to disturb, Mr. Lee. Would you like another bottle? Sure thing. Yes, you can't make it. I was really about to call you. Listen, the call came in last minute and I think I nailed the audition. The director wants to meet me in LA, so I'm already on the plane and I can't believe this is finally happening. Yeah, me neither. What's wrong? Russ, we've been through this too many times. Not enough, apparently. You know what? Maybe we should take a break. I can't deal with this right now. You should be I'm happy done. for me. Hey, I'm telling you, the shop is closed. Go away, or... I need a haircut. Sorry, we're closed. You can come back tomorrow. This has to be fixed now. Or... Or what? Or there won't be a tomorrow. Wait. Just give me a second. Promise me you're not laugh. Okay. I'm not kidding. Sure. But a little passe, don't you think? It's a Z. Stands for Zoe. My name. Yeah, I know. Hey, I'll return the favor. Oh. I'm a man on my word. You really don't know who I am. You know, when you asked me for some time off, I thought you were joking. You don't answer my calls, my messages. The great Russell Lee, who's never taken a day off in his life, completely disappears off the face of this earth. So please. 
Tell me there's one good reason for that. What time is it? Day. You mean day. It's Tuesday. Three days since you've vanished. <sighs> it's Kara. Oh, I know. It's all over the news. Kara Orchard heads to Hollywood for new movie roles. I'll just close the curtains. I'm going blind. And that wasn't even the biggest headline. They are calling it Zoe Special. Where's she from? No clue, but Gina's trying to locate her as we speak because Aries wants her to be his stylist. But we managed to convince him to let her join the trainee program instead, just to keep him happy, you know? What happened? So we had an exclusive contract? Yeah, well, our boy needed a hacker urgently, and you were nowhere to be found. That's enough. So the boss asked someone else to do it instead. And? <clears throat> she. She tried to give him a perm. A perm? Are you kidding me? Harry's had a fit and he stormed out, apparently turning to a barber shop nearby, and the rest is history. And the boss is unfortunately threatening to replace you. Replace me? Don't they know who I am? Well, I think it's time to remind them who Russell Lee really is. Gina, Air is Tan's manager. Congratulations. You look stunned. This is your work, right? Yes. And this is where you work. Yes. Her time? All the time. I live here. <laughs> Seriously? Seriously. What is this about? Well, as of this moment, you no longer work here. I'm here to offer you a position at Cutting Edge as a trainee. Cutting Edge? As in the Cutting Edge? Yes. What's going on? Uncle, your employee has just quit. I will compensate you if that's what you're about to ask. Uh, he's my dad. Oh. Uncle. Your daughter has just quit. She'll be joining Cutting Edge as a trainee for three months and much longer if she becomes the top trainee. I don't know what Aries is thinking, but he sees something in you. I worked my ass off for this. Be great. I need time to think about this. You can't be serious. Nobody, literally nobody, rejects a chance to work at Cutting Edge. Well, I am a nobody. You're seriously rejecting a chance to work at Cutting Edge to stay here? Here is where she grew up. And I'm afraid she will have to turn you down. Oh well, a top trainee will earn a full-time position and earn a lot more than thousands. This is my card. You keep the contract. Call me ASAP. I'm about to fly out in a couple of days and oh, I'm not big on it. Zoe. Oh, you're still awake. I bought you your favorite peanut pancake. I'm not hungry. Yeah, this should be enough to clear some of the debts. I can't take this. And how are we going to keep the shop? We don't have to keep the shop. Oh, you can't give it up, Ba. It's your life. This shop will mean nothing when it becomes a burden to us. We 
We have another three months. I'm sure there's something we can do. You think it's so easy to win top training? They are called cutting edge for a reason. Well, I'm not giving up without trying, Ba. Why can't you just listen to me? What are your chances? You are going to be disappointed. So you don't think I have what it takes? Uh, that's not what I meant. You don't say that, but that's how you feel. Bye, you've always been a bad liar. Look, I'm saying all this for your own good. You might hate me now, but one day you're going to thank me for it. Don't we at least deserve a chance to keep Ma's dream alive? I miss your Ma every single day. But the truth is that she's gone and there's nothing we can do. That's the reality. And maybe we should learn how to face it. Isha and Eureka, your mentors, Roxy, please remember their names. Hi, I you know. must be Zoe. Remington. All right, everyone. This is Zoe, and just like you, she'll be part of the training program. Starting tomorrow, you will shed blood. Can you please? Starting tomorrow, you will shed blood, sweat, and tears. Some of you may give up, and many of you may not make it. Only the finest will be selected. Since I've assigned you your mentors, learn and ask as many questions as you can. This is your best shot and becoming the next top hairstylist of Cutting Edge and Asia. Uh, sorry, I don't have a mentor. How long have you been working here? Uh, eight months. Good. Don't bother coming in tomorrow. Uh, I'm sorry, I promise I can do better. Hi. I'm Zoe. Nice to meet you. And where are you from? Uh, my family runs a neighborhood barbershop. So, zero experience. I'm not Aries. This doesn't work. I'm sure we're all going to have a wonderful time here. Good luck and welcome to the cutting edge. <laughs>